Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem eleven, a、uh, problem eight in chapter eleven. In this chapter, we talk about angular momentum. In this one, we can see for this system, for this person, we know its mass, the radius, for the the uniform cylinder, right? We consider her as a uniform cylinder, and then the angular velocity is given. We convert the unit revolution per second to radius per second. The first question: We need to find the angular momentum. So for angular momentum, we know it is I times omega naught. And omega naught is given, so we need to find the i for momentum of a ratio for a uniform cylinder. You can check your this test book is one half m r square. Now we input the i inside, we get the function for its angular momentum. Input the number, you get the answer there. The second one, we need to find the torque if we require to slow her to stop in five seconds. So that means in this case the final angular velocity is zero because it stop right, and time taken is five seconds. Now we see we need to find the torque. The torque is I times alpha. I times alpha. Alpha we don't know. I we don't know. So we can use our previous way to find the momentum of a ratio for this uniform cylinder one half m r square. And then angular acceleration, you can see you know the final angular velocity, you know initial angular velocity, and you know time taking. So it's so easy for you to get angular acceleration. Now we input i and omega in i and alpha inside this function. We get the function for torque, and input the known quantity inside. Get final answer there. Thank you.